Welcome to Prakanong Market. I've recently started living in Thailand and for that reason, I want to make sure that I live like the locals much as I can to have a genuine experience. And living like the locals often means saving a bunch of money on your produce. And so if you're here, you definitely don't want to go to a supermarket. You want to go to one of these open air markets and spend 40 cents on something that would cost $3 where you to go to like something here would be like a big C is like the Walmart equivalent or something like that. I also love how many incredibly friendly animals that you find while you're walking through these little narrow streets. And it is not uncommon for them to come up to you and want to be pet and it's all very cute and fun. They're quite lazy, of course, because it's so hot, but uh, lazy and chilled. The skill of some of the people that you come across here as well was another highlight. Uh, this woman who prepared prawns for us. We got a half kilogram, um, so much more affordable than when we got it at the supermarket, just hitting that point home again and again. Uh, but also, when I buy things at the supermarket, I had to do all the prep, and she did that for us, removing all the shells. It was really helpful. Uh, here is an interesting shot seeing the contrast between, for example, the, call it the Undercity, compared to some of the behemoth condominiums that you see here as well. It's not all food, too. When you're walking through, you can, as we had, come across a random thing like this shrine, which is quite beautiful. And gives you even more photo opportunities. So you're going to see cool things in the market. You're going to see food, produce, religious symbols, all of these interesting things to absorb while you're here. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that you like, I hope that you subscribe, and most of all, I hope that you share it so others can enjoy this little slice of Thailand. Thanks for watching. Catch you in the next one.